Thank you, President. Institute for Human Rights expresses its gratitude to the Office of the High Commissioner for Permanent Monitoring of the Human Rights Situation in the UN Member States. However, IHR would like to draw attention of the Council to repeated breaches of the international law committed by Azerbaijani authorities. The government has intensified attacks on the freedom of expression and assembly, and an alleged dialogue with political parties resulted in the termination of activities for a number of them. From the beginning of 2023, according to the data of local and international human rights organizations, the number of political prisoners in Azerbaijan increased twice, with the cases of Gubade Badugli and Bakhtiar Hajiv being the most outrageous examples of the suppression of critical voices. Such events may testify the more excessive repressions and human rights violations will emerge during the upcoming elections in an already over-restrictive society. IHR would like to call on the Human Rights Council to look closely to the limitations imposed by the Azerbaijani government on the unaliable human rights and freedoms, as well as facilitate the democratic changes in the country. IHR is particularly distressed by politically motivated reprisals and urges the Republic of Azerbaijan to put an end to illegal persecution of activists, public figures, media workers, lawyers, trade union members and human rights defenders. I thank you.